the Chadian president, Mamad Idris Debi, has just banned a march against the French forces in the country. This march, which was to take place this week, has been organized by the Revolutionary Movement for Democracy and Peace. To reaffirm this, the Minister of Security of Chad mentioned the risk of disturbing the public order. According to Remat, principal researcher for the Institute of Security Studies for Central Africa and Lake Chad Basin, this ban is yet another hardening of the Chadian political context since Mahmoud Idris Debi came to power. He also believes that the Chadian government is rather using its office to ban any protest that would not be in its favor. Noting that since their departure from the country of the Alliance of Sahel States, Chad has become France's last base. In the Sahel, thousands of French soldiers have retreated to Chad to help in, count in counter-terrorism operations. Oh, wow. Um, if this is the position of the president saying no to protest, it has to be maintained. And he said, the minister said, it's for peace and public order to be maintained. So you have to maintain it. The president has spoken. You see, that is, this is one of the problems we have in some of our countries. You say we are in a democratic system of government, but people, not, people are not allowed to express their views, their opinion through protest. Protest is the only way citizens can come out and the, the, like display their anger over anything they don't like. And you're depriving them that right. And you still come and tell us we are in a democracy. We are in a democratic system. It's quite really unfortunate that the leaders we have today do not practice what they actually should. Yes, that's the problem. It's in so many countries today in Africa. Citizens cannot come out to protest. Thank you so very much for your time again with me. I don't take it for granted. Hope to see you in my next as I bring you away again more trending news. Bye.